Hey there. This week we're going to talk about sitting with the instrument or placing the instrument where you need it to be. Um, with electric guitar, uh, I kind of like having it here. When I stand up with the guitar, which I'll stand up and have my head chopped off here, when I'm playing, all right, this is actually going to put the instrument, you know, gravity and the strap is going to place the instrument kind of centered on my body like this. Uh, I kind of like this because the first thing is that we have this this angle right here and that angle allows me to pick straight up and down with the pick and we've got kind of a 45 degree angle on the string so it makes it a little bit easier to pass the pick through the next thing we'll come down here uh, it, you know is that it puts the strings at that angle for my fingertips if I hold my hands up like this you know your fingers kind of naturally fall off at an angle if, if we've got the guitar like this you're kind of tilting the hand, which is a little bit less comfortable to me at least. You know, keep in mind with all of these technique things, uh, these are the things that I found that work best for my own playing. And I try and teach them to my students because it gives them a really good starting point. And then they kind of have to work it for their style and the instrument they play and, you know, their physical size and all that other stuff. All right? But the reality is that this seems to work pretty good for the majority of the people that I teach. Now, if you notice, when I sit down, the guitar is still in the same place, all right? I get my angle right here for the right hand, all right? And I get that angle for my uh, hand right here. It's almost like I'm playing, oops, it's almost like I'm playing classical guitar, you know, where normally with classical guitar, you'd have a footstool, all right? And you'd be propping the instrument up and you'd, you'd actually have this sort of thing going on. You don't see someone play classical guitar like this. Now when we strum, you know, you see a lot of strummy players playing this way. Um, you see a lot of people without a strap, it's just easier to do it. But if you notice, when I went from playing like this to playing like this, suddenly, you know, the top part of my body shifted around. I have to pick at a different angle with my picking hand. You know, my, my left hand is not so hard, it just it tilts under like this a little bit. And the thing that most of my students run into is if they start off like this and then they go to stand up to play in a jam or in a band or, or any other situation where they're standing with the instrument the way they've been practicing isn't consistent with the way they're actually going to play the instrument all right if we actually keep our practice position consistent with your playing position you have a better chance of it not being a complete train wreck when you actually go out and play all right so for me this is the best thing you know i try and find it where the strap holds the instrument without it you know having to be supported by my body uh, i try and sit upright uh you know i'm guilty of doing this all the time that's yeah, one of the worst things all right, for any number of reasons i get students where they they practice at home sitting in front of the tv on the couch doing this you know and you know it, it makes everything real difficult you know if you just let the instrument go where gravity is going to put it all right, it's actually, I think it's going to, overall, it's going to make it easier for your hands to work on the instrument. But you want to practice like you're going to play. You know, you don't want to uh, practice the instrument one way and then get up to perform and, and do it some other way. Um, for me, we've got that reason. I also think that having the instrument like this, at least for me, for myself, is it's uncomfortable because of the top part of my body shifting. So I'm off center, which isn't healthy for your back. Um, but then also pulls this hand around and everything just has to physically address the instrument differently. All right. So that's, that's kind of the major thing for me with sitting with the instrument.